What are you drinking, Gideon? This is a Manhattan Up because I think it's very dignified. I have a gin gimlet and I'm very glad that it's not up because I feel like I would just be spilling it all over the place. The harvest is about crisis of faith. So if there's the absence of faith, what is left? And like, how do you deal with that, that experience? I play a character named Josh. His family life has been very tough, and then his best friend brought him to church um, when he was about 13 years old, and he plans to devote the rest of his life to helping people. Tom is Josh's best friend. He has a lot of reservations, mm -hmm. but I don't think I can talk about what they are. Yeah, maybe not. But he's anxious. He's an anxious I'll give guy. you that. He totally is. Right. We're both music lovers, though. So, yes, and, yes. Which is kind of... Classical music. Classical music. Gideon, if you could <laughs> stage door anyone living or dead, who would it be? I'm going to pick Heather Headley. <laughs> because I used to take bubble baths and listen to Aida. What is the best acting advice you've ever gotten? That you are enough. And just trusting that I am an interesting enough person that people would want to watch me. What about you? It's not important that you feel, but it's important that the audience feels. Yeah. To come to a place, you know, like Lincoln Center, and you walk out in the plaza, and there's these massive structures, and you see like the Met and the Vivian Beaumont, and then to come up here into this like beautiful, intimate space where we can tell a story about the real people in a very kind of intimate way. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>